Love has 500 wings, each of which reaches from the divine throne to the lowest earth. Jalaluddin Rumi was beyond the boundaries which create the limitations of our lives. He existed without the differences which divide men and saw the signs of Allah in the horizon of everyday life. There are so many dimensions to the being of Rumi that is really impossible to exhaust a knowledge, however cursory, of all of his different aspects. This incredible sage, metaphysician, man of God, poet, and artist. Jalaluddin Rumi was allowed a portion of the knowledge of God. He was an ocean. If you place an empty glass into the ocean, what is in the glass is the ocean. Yet it is not the ocean. Every age has its own language, but language of Rumi for every age. Jalaluddin Rumi was a university professor until late in October in 1244, when he met a king in a patched robe, the wandering Sufi, a lover of the Prophet Muhammad, the son of Tabriz, Shamsuddin, who opened his heart to the secrets which were beyond books. The jealousy of Rumi's students caused Shams to disappear. Nevlana changed. He now spoke poetry as never before. He whirled around reciting poems which expressed his longing and love and astonishment with his own transformed state. He ordered morning robes, a white shirt open at the chest, and a honey-colored wool fez. The unseen center, the motionless unseen center, is the divine presence and everything is concentrated on that. If we do not strive for inner perfection, we will remain what we are now, talking animals. This dance is the most eloquent image of what man was and what he must again become. There is a force within that gives you life. Seek that. In your body there lies a priceless jewel Seek that. O oh, wandering Sufi, if you are in search of the greatest treasure, don't look outside. Look within and seek that. Listen to the reed, how it tells a tale complaining of separation, saying ever since I was parted from the reed bed, my lament has caused man and woman to moan. Music is uplifting to the listener. The neigh has a system of seven holes. They relate the holes in the head of a person. The bottom hole represents the mouth and is rarely opened, indicating that the mouth should not always be open. Rhythm, voice, and melody work together in such a way as to create a monotonous sound, which is the basis of Mevlevi music. The monotonous music takes one's attention and guides it toward meditation. Mevlevi music is not for listening, it is for participation. The similitude of this world is that of a garment torn from end to end, but which remains attached by a thread at one extremity. That thread is almost broken. This thread is the remainder of life for each of us. Its length is a secret known only to God. The repetition of there is no reality but God is a polish for the heart. It is a satisfaction for the heart it dissolves the hardening of attitudes which has caused a crust to form on the heart. (laughs) 
Everyone in the world has chosen a friend, and ours is love. Through love, all that is bitter will be sweet. Through love, all that is copper will be gold. Through love, all dregs will turn to purest wine. Through love, all pain will turn to medicine. Through love, the dead will all become alive. Appear as you are, be as you appear. person is the place of divine manifestation. The lover visible and the beloved invisible. Who ever saw such a love in all the world? The Garib, or secret Sema, has not been seen for over a hundred years. After the Sema, the door is locked. No visitors are present. There are no lights except for a candle. And some of the elders in Semizen turn as Rumi did before them. <laughs> 